<laughs> Go ahead, mom. So the next one is uh, Wendy's husband is ex husband. Ex husband, sorry, ex husband is now. Child, speaking of in season and out, my God, run the tape. All of you miserable and 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 women on my page are gonna be very mad. But for the smart people, for the smart people who understand the plight of, I'm not trying to play victim. Again, I take full accountability. A lot of y'all still don't know what's going on, and you still won't know what's going on. And as per the documentary that you just saw, which was whatever, I knew nothing about it, you still don't know what's going on. And guess what? There was nothing good that came out of that. Nothing good came out of the documentary. So I don't know what was this display for. All of the people that were involved, the celebrities, half of them were involved in enabling her. So Black China, you need to go sit down before I air you out and let you know, let people know what you really did. There's a lot of, there's a lot, but I'm not here for that. Listen, you miserable women, please stay off my page. Just stay off my page. Pray for the people that's involved. Pray for my ex-wife. Pray for Wendy Williams. Hunter. Pray for Wendy Williams. Pray that for the family. Pray for everybody that's involved. And whatever I'm out here doing and whatever people think I'm doing, Guess what? If I don't go out here and do it, who the f is going to do What are we going to do? We're going to just let everybody, whatever the display is, whoever's in charge, they clearly don't care. So, And, I, and I've been minding my business. I've been doing what I got to do to make these announcements that I'm about to make to show that I am working hard and I'm going to keep working. My legacy is not over. Whatever I have to do for the legacy that still includes my entire family is still not over. My son is looking. My daughter's looking. My lady is looking. Everybody's looking now. So at this point, you know, if you don't really care, if you still caught up on that geometry or that news about whatever, you don't really see what's going on here, the real plight, then okay. But please, I'm going to ask you to please refrain, you women, refrain from my comments. Refrain, go get a life, go get a man, go get some peace, go do whatever you need to do. But please stop worrying about Kelvin. Oh, wait. Oh, sorry. Bitch. First of all, I love the way, and, and I, don't, I don't support nothing that Kevin do. First of all, he looked like one of them sperm whales. Did you see the size of his head? his head. <laughs> when that nigga said, you whores. <laughs> said, you, mother, you whores. So I was like, oh, this is definitely a fag. <laughs> Please believe. How do I? But. <sighs> You done ran that woman down in the ground. He took my his my, that, my lady. Like, girl. <clears throat> he done ran that woman crazy. That's all that woman ever remember is she divorced from Kevin. That's it. <laughs> she can't remember the powder she snorted up under that fucking chair. She can't remember the bags of dope that she had up under that purple chair, bitch. But she can remember she divorced from Kevin. Eyes big as a fucking goddamn the, the, the rings around Saturn. <laughs> I am so, like, aggravated with him. It's just like you done ran that lady. And this is why it's important to really be clear about who you are when you go into a relationship and just not lose yourself. I always felt like she lost herself in that marriage. You know what I mean? Because like even on the show, she would always talk about how she didn't have time for girlfriends. Oh, I ain't got time for friends. You know, I got a husband and a son. You know, I leave the show. I go home. I got a husband. I go cook. I got a husband. You know. I got a husband. I'm just like, girl. And they didn't have a prenup. So everything she made, he got some of. She, she knew he knew the plan. Put dick to a bitch like that. You know her leg was big as the as big as motherfucking goddamn water bottles. He came in and controlled her for like real. That she needed him. Yes, it gave her some attention that already <laughs> had his mind set on another bitch. Right, and this is what I be saying to the ladies that watch us. Like when you when you've built yourself. When you've built your life, built your career, built your business, built a home for yourself, and then you find you find a man, you get into a relationship with a man, and then you let him start running shit, taking control of shit that you built. That's this this why I can't be there. This why I can't be there. That that's a part of being a wife. I think you can be in love and be mm -hmm. with somebody and not let them take over your shit. Any, anybody to come in right now? All of this is mine. Definitely. Both of my homes, 
my not, name, my brand, my businesses. This belongs to me. So when so when you guys get married, I didn't say I was getting married. Oh, you're I gonna am. Gonna get married? I'm gonna get. I married. mean, I'm open to it, but you know, like I'm like, gonna get married. I ain't seen nothing <laughs> different yet. Okay, I ain't seen nothing different. Okay, but let's just say you guys are. Let's just say you guys are going to get married, and you're with your partner. So you don't believe that? Wait a minute. Who's the guys, partner? No, 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 I said partner. partner. Oh, I feel sick because neither one of us have a partner. No, I said a part. I we're, said part. we're homeowners. <laughs> <laughs> Multiple on the way. <laughs> no, I was going to say once you guys get your partners, you, okay. don't be- you don't believe like once you're in a marriage. I'm not even saying girlfriend, boyfriend. I'm saying marriage. Once you're in a marriage, you don't believe you guys share everything. No, are you fucking crazy? We're gonna share the house. It's just mine. Yeah, because I've already bought it. We'll live together. Your name will not be on the lease or the, on the deed. Or and, and the moment that I die, you're to be evicted. I put that in my. I, listen, I got a will. What's of, you, what's, what's, excuse me, what's I have a will. Away, excuse you, me, excuse me. Listen very closely. My last will and testament upstairs, and in and and in, in, in my safety deposit box, and it's with my mom and them states that who whomever I'm in a relationship with, when I perish. They have 24 hours to, va- excuse me, 48, I give them 48, 48 hours to vacate the premises. 48. If you don't believe me, I'll show you before you leave this house. <laughs> it says 48 hours to vacate the premises at, at whichever address, whatever entity that I own and operate, they have 48 hours to vacate the premises to gather whatever they can gather and leave. Because what will not happen is the bitch that you was fucking off on me because you are and you will fuck off on me will be laying on those sheets and arriving to my funeral basking in my things bitch while I'm while I cross over to the great to the great beyond now nah, it's in my will right now 48 now, hours my okay. thing my thing is uh-huh. anything that we acquire together we will share but, but anything that I had before so that means it's you better mine. that means you better have you enough of your motherfucking savings to get to have you a home because bitch the home that because that will be this that will be broken up in between my blood relatives my brother his children my brothers their children my my nephews and things like that okay so basically for you guys marriage, i don't see a man to that level so basically for you guys, i don't see a man marriage on the, is, marriage is just in that time frame, just the, the time get, that we share, just to keep I don't see you. you die. I don't see you on that level. I don't give a fuck how much I'm in love with you. I don't see you on that level for you to be riding around in a car with a bitch that I, that I didn't fuck with. Do that in your own car. But that, that's you assuming that he's going to do that. that. It shall happen. You see, and that's what I'm saying. You, you, you're, you're bringing. <laughs> Somebody you're, said he can't even mourn. He don't need to mourn. You're manifested that, Maddie. Really? When you break that out, you're Okay, well, for, he has 48 hours. <laughs> I just look at it different. He has 48 if hours. If I marry to somebody, that ain't your that, Because I just look no, at it. No, that's and, not. Well, if my, I marry somebody, the person that I'm married with, they have access to all my stuff. Okay. So if I do die. While we're together. While we're together. And, but but should I de- say I pass away? Should I, I'm always going to. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I'm always going to be the rich one. So should I perish before them? They should have enjoyed the life that we had together because the new one they, they, he needs that he starts, they need to do that together without mine anything to do with me. Enjoy the time that we've had, bask in those memories, and start you some new a new legacy. My thought is, I, I couldn't leave anybody. I could if I love that person, I couldn't leave it with nothing. Really? I can't leave it. With oh, nothing. My, my, we'll, we'll my give them everything. Is, give them their flowers while both of y'all can see I them. Can't leave it because they get nothing from me. My thought is, we'll have to buy a home <laughs> together. If you want to have your name on the house, then we need to do that together. Okay. But this one is mine. And if we do buy a home together, I'm still going to keep my house because I'm going to use that as an investment. Okay. I'll rent it out, you know, da 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 da. And they say, does somebody, what if they did it to me? I'm, I, I'm okay with that because that's our time. Because please believe if he perishes, I'm definitely going to pick my phone up. I told you to check back with me in 30 days. <laughs> He gone. Now, I, now you would feel some kind of way if you were married to a man who had money, right? And he left you with nothing. Well, you, I'm, well, see, here's the thing about it. I'm not a dummy bitch. Correct. No, but we're just saying hypothetically, if the man was the one that had all the money, uh-huh. and y'all got together, I'm not. And he, it, let's just say, let's would, just say he, let's just say he died, 
and he left you with Maddie. He and told me to evacuate in 48 hours? Yes. I'll be moving into my mansion. But you wouldn't feel, no, you, but you wouldn't feel some type of way? He, our time is done. But you wouldn't feel some she type would. of way? I, here's the thing. Our time is done. I can't have children. <laughs> we don't have any children together. I can't, he can't, he can nut in me all day. I can lay down, let that man nut in me until there's no nut left in his balls. <laughs> I can't have his children. <laughs> I cannot have his children. <laughs> so the things that he's giving me while I'm while I'm living, I'm investing that just in case he should perish. <laughs> Sorry, you're something else, Maddie. So just in case there's anyone inter interested in dating me, and you think that you're going to poison me, you get nothing. Now, if I have, if we have kids together, <laughs> nothing. You, then I definitely would make provisions that you had. Well, something. how are you gonna have children? You, you, no, I'm saying like we can adopt. We may, we may, no, I, I don't want to adopt. I, oh. I mean, we would do. Um, oh, surrogacy. A surrogacy. So if he go out there, he fuck the bitch that he's cheating on me with, and he bring home a baby, and we supposed to raise it together, they're all cut off. No, how, we'll, we'll have a time when we're together. We'll we'll have we'll raise we'll be with his children that he has <laughs> and he's together because I'm not because I'm not a female and I can't Thanks, provide please. him children from my womb and we'll let him and then once once we have once he once I have perished if God takes me before he takes him they have to start their life with they have to have their life over there but I'm saying Maddie okay, our life is done but I'm saying Maddie like I'm not even saying you give him all of your stuff but you're going to leave him with nothing well, he the, should, man, the man that you supposedly love I do love him you know show it if you want to leave him I'm with loving nothing. him while he's here <laughs> I'm loving him while he's here. <laughs> while he's here. And you're going to leave him with nothing? I'm not leaving him for anything for them. <laughs> no, I said leave For him. them. No, because it's them. definitely a them. <laughs> I'm not leaving anything for them. No. <laughs> my will, my last will and testament states that if, I, if, that if I'm in a relationship with any, and I'm not amending that. If I'm in a relationship with any man uh -huh. and we're living together, he has 48 hours to evacuate the premises. That's kind of cold. And that, the, and that because, and my shit is in the trust. And so that the enforcers of my trust, you know, have the ability to he, evict him from the, from the premises. He gets nothing. You got it all while you were here. Enjoy the life that we have together. You're not worthy to be to be spending the things that I've worked hard for and my riches with some other motherfucker. That's not theirs. That's ours. But then once once I'm gone, it's mine, and it's it's my nephews. My you know, I'm still leaving them something because they deserve it because they're my kin, they're my blood. Uh -huh. I don't know you like that. I don't care how what many. Do you, mean? you married the person. I don't care how many nuts you busted me. I don't but know you, you. But if you're, I'm not saying boy, Maddie. I this don't know you I'm like that. I don't care how much DNA we share. I'm not saying boyfriend or or jump off. I'm saying marriage. So you can't say that. You don't know this person. If you marry this person, of course you're never going to obviously know somebody 100%. That's never going to happen. But the fact that you married this person must have said, "Okay, this person set themselves apart from everybody else." And so did my and so did my assets set themselves apart from him. <laughs> because he will never be planning his great escape after I'm gone. Or, you know, cuz who know who's to say that I haven't been eating rice. <laughs> well, don't do that. Don't do that. Do that, not do that, Maddie. It's, a, it's an inside joke. <laughs> Who's to say that I'm not eating rice, that I've been fed rice, or 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 arsenic, or some form of antifreeze during the time of our marriage with this great love? Who's to say? Okay. Once the time is up, you should have you should have saved you enough in your separate account. You should have pinched off some of those five dollar bills or twenties. Oh. <laughs> and put you a separate thing to be good after I'm gone because enjoy it while it's, it's like a vacation you're on vacation enjoy your vacation because when you leave your vacation you leave that room we got to get that yeah you leave that room you leave that resort you leave that great food you leave those you leave all of those things right there you leave it there okay. and you had a good time it was great and you go on with your life Unfortunately, once you die, you can't return back to that resort. <laughs> mm. You don't feel that way, Greg? I agree with some of what you're saying. I don't. I don't agree completely. Um, I, I just think that if I and my partner had kids together, then surely I'm going to set up provisions for them to be provided for. You know, for him to take care of the kids and 
you know, whatever, whatever, whatever. He better, he but better. I don't have kids he, and I don't have a partner. So if I had a kid and they had a partner, if I was with a partner, like I know someone right now, if who, I had a partner and they had a kid, they better enjoy the life that they had while we were together. They better enjoy, we better enjoy our children together and all this stuff because, again, what I've worked for is going to my blood. Well, I mean, like, for me, like, I, I, I know that I would leave something to my partner. Like, if we were in good standing at my death. How do you know that you're in good standing? I'm saying, like, if, 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 if I feel like we're in a good space, then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to provide something. That doesn't mean I'm going to leave all of them. Somebody the said wives mourn husband. Wives mourn husbands remarry. You're not. I'm not giving y'all. I'm not giving you a bounty, a dowry, yeah, like, a uh, dowry. What, what was the What was the the model's name uh, that died? Uh, and she had Alzheimer's or dementia or something. Her husband moved in. The caretaker who happened to be a white woman. Did you see that? What was that? What was that? I, I can't name? remember that. But you, see, I, re I can't remember the name. But you see, you remember that? B Smith. Yes, or something like that. B Smith. And uh, men typically will get married faster. Completely faster. Um, them dicks ready to move but that was her career and that was her i would imagine i don't know what the husband well, did so it's but unfair wives to get say married too. wives do but they at a slower pace unless they've killed the husband if a man's been married to a woman for a long period of time you can almost guarantee that he's going to get remarried within two to five years within if not within motherfucking they, 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 they get, they with, with it, within 90 days oh, yeah, yeah they become long? accustomed to having a woman in their life somebody to take care of them and you know, all that kind of stuff. But how long do you think somebody should hold off meeting somebody new after their partner? Go do your thing, but just not with my money. <laughs> You're not going to wall this bitch with my money. <laughs> no. I didn't let you wall. You were, you probably was warning that bitch with my money when I was alive and I didn't know about it, but I definitely am dead. You're not going to do it. No. 